Hey YouTube, it's your boy Genius Me. I got a, a tech on. It's not Nike. I don't care about clothing brands. I don't care about designer. Nike don't give a about us, bro. Nike, I, I don't even know if Nike likes black people. I don't know. A lot of the brands that we wear could hate us, but we still gonna wear it. You wanna know why? Because other people are gonna be like, damn, you got that? You got that? Are you wearing clothes for you? Or are you wearing clothes for how other people see you wearing them? Think about that. Are you wearing clothes because of how other people look at you when you're wearing them? Or are you wearing them for you? Think about that. I don't think those type of people, I could thrift shop. If you know how to throw it on, you know how to throw it on. It don't matter what it is. Hey, this tech is high quality. Only thing it's missing is a Nike sign. And you telling me it's invalid all because of a Nike sign? What? I'm not that stupid. COVID proved one thing to me is that it really doesn't matter if it's bootleg or real. It's all up to the imagination. Like, look at this mask. This joint say Under Armour on it. All they did was copy and paste Under Armour on a white mask. And you buy it and people think you got an Under Armour mask on now. They didn't crack the code. If I was somebody who really cared enough to wear certain brands i could literally print a nike symbol where the nike symbol would be on these but you gonna tell me it's not real nobody's gonna check the tag on the back bro they're just gonna be like oh you got a tech on where the f is his nike sign your set's fake bro what is someone telling me that my set is fake bro i'm gonna look at them like like what bro are you stupid or something bro i don't give a f <laughs> Now what else? This mask says Nike Cat the Jack. This joint is made by Collection Best. We are too consumed by these brands. It's not that serious. Nothing is that serious, bro. You can make your own Nike socks. Go get a white pair of socks, right? And put Nike on it. Nike socks. We as people add value to what we buy. We made it valuable by spending that amount of money on it. I could make a crayon right now, right? Stick it in my booty. And since because I have a million followers on Instagram or because I made a song with Kanye West, that crayon could go for $50,000. All because I'm a celebrity. We add value to whatever we buy. Whatever is in demand at the price that it's at, like those red boots that everybody are wearing on social media, the Astro boots, we add value to us buying it. They're like $340, right? Since a lot of people bought it at that price, it made it that valuable. I don't hate those boots at all. I think that they are a step into futuristic clothing. Like clothing we benefit to have that's why when it came out everybody's like ew and because people aren't creative bro people are are too uptight with life those boots are actually dope it's because people want to be so older and forget that we're kids still bro our moms our grannies are still kids they don't know everything and that's the thing we don't know everything so trying to be an adult and act like an adult when you're still a kid that's the problem we grow up and we be like oh let me start acting my age our age is infinite you think time is Nah, I ain't even going. I ain't even getting that deep. I don't care, bro. I, I am a thrift shop kind of guy. I can find some dope stuff at the thrift shop. And you ain't going to tell me that it's phony. You going to be like, where you get that from? Hey, yo, that look dope. Man, this was $2. My pants was $5. These shoes were $40. Oh, wow. I be feeling good when I find a whole outfit for cheap. Because it's an outfit, bro. I'm going to wear it like what? Not even wear it what? Because I get my money's worth out of stuff. I be wearing stuff nowadays when i was younger i would buy something once and not understand the value of what i was wearing i would buy it once and only wear it one time but when i buy stuff now i think about how many times i will wear it before i buy it i'd be like all right these uh the fake night you said i can just throw this on when i gotta shoot or whenever i just want to throw something on real quick i can just throw it on i don't put too much thought into certain stuff because you shouldn't bro you shouldn't i always try to be myself and i always stick to what i believe is right for me brand I don't care about them. I really don't. Hopefully this video was entertaining to you and you gained a little bit of information about who I am. This video is one of those videos that displayed my uh, personality. It's your boy Daniel Smith. Thanks for watching.